So I figured I'd do a video on this Coleman stove I have here. This is the Peak One Model 576. You don't see a whole lot of these. Um, I mean, you see the Peak Ones uh, floating around out there, but you don't see a ton of the, the 576s. So these are made in Canada um, in the Coleman Canadian factory. So they're very reliable. They work well. Um, they run on, you know, they'll run on regular gasoline, unleaded gasoline. They'll run on white gas, Coleman fuel. So on the right side here, you have your flame control. Basically, it takes your flame from nothing up to a raging inferno. So very good flame control. Um, on the bottom here, you have your pump to pressurize the fount. On the back side here, you have your fuel shut off, on and off. Um, filler cap for adding fuel to the tank and then on top here you have your brass um, generator which takes the liquid fuel turns it into a vapor which is then is burned inside the burner cup so lightweight backpack stove um, compared to today's backpacking stoves it's I mean it's not really comparable but back in the day it was probably the best thing you could have um, I prefer this type of stove over the remote liquid fuel stoves like the MSR, uh, Whisperlite International, or any, any of those stoves like that. I just prefer it because you don't have a tank with a hose and then your burner, it's basically one design, clean, and done. So, these stoves usually go right around, oh, like 80 to $120. Um, I just happened to pick this one up for, um, believe it or not, five bucks. So I basically stole this one <laughs> so very good condition very reliable they always work um, just clean them out once in a while so pretty cool design this lever is actually your flame control but it also cleans the the fuel jet which is inside of here so basically fuel goes up comes across goes inside here um, down inside here in there is the air intake as well as where the fuel is mixed and then there's a set two um fiberglass pads which basically soak up the fuel um, which would probably help in colder weather um so similar design to the 502 which is a pretty common design you've probably seen these floating around um, another great stove very reliable yeah, thanks for watching.